Okay, I was just searching the web, and I happened to find your video, and you told me what this gas mask was. Previously, I was thinking it was Korea or Vietnam, but now I know what it is. Mine is an adult medium. Um, it, you know, one-time filter, like you said, I believe you are correct. Uh, mine doesn't have the valve. That is the one thing, the exhale valve. Uh, my eyepieces, unlike yours, uh, but mine's in overall worse condition, they're still good. Um, I've wore it, and it does seal to my face still. The straps are a little rough, but they're still usable. I mean, they're just a little ragged at the end. Um, mine does not seal real well to the filter. See, I can take it, and it will slide down and up and down a little bit. Um, it's, a uh, pretty odd. I'm going to try to put mine on, so if you don't mind just sitting, i got to set down the camera real quick so I can put it on. Yeah, see... And if I plug the hole, the, my valve and filter still works. The reason I have to plug the hole is because of that. I'm not, I'm missing the exhale valve. Uh, you know, it's, mine's the USM1. It's lot 48-1. Uh... I have three gas masks total. I've actually lost one. I can't find it. But I also have a World War One gas mask. That thing's really old. It's American and I don't know much more about it. Uh, but anyway, I thought it was just cool that we had the same mask. I paid a lot more for mine. I paid like 15 bucks and your dad paid a quarter. <laughs> but um, I'm also going to post this video to YouTube. YouTube. Uh, this gas mask is for protection against chemical or against chemical warfare agents only. Dis um, dispense air free instructions. Head the head harness on the face piece should be adjusted only t tight enough to ensure a gas tight fit. Test for leakage. Place your hand firmly over the inlet at the bottom of the canister intake holes. The faceplate will draw inward against your fa face if tight. Leakage occurs around the edges of the face piece. Adjust the harness to prevent eyepieces of mask from fogging. Wipe the inner surface of each eye piece clean with soft cloths. Breathe on the cleanest surface of a piece of soap to moisten them. Rub so soap twice against the inside of the eyepiece. Again, breathe on the eye piece. Rub the soap. Evenly over the surface with the tip of the finger. Handle the mask, especially the eyepieces, with care. Um, it says, then it says, at all times so that. Uh, sorry, see, it's hard to read. It's getting covered up. Um, protection will be furnished when needed. That's all the instructions on the side. So, yeah, the M1 gas mask, um, wonder if that has anything to do with the M1 Grand, like it was part of the, um, stuff they issued. Anyway, but that was really cool that you showed me what that was, um, and if you have any idea where to get this, uh, fil or the little exhale filter, see the, the threads are still there, I just don't have the piece, tell me, cause, um, yeah, I would like to get it working, uh, I could probably seal off the bottom if I put my mind to it with some, uh, I don't know, some tape, not not tape, uh, Teflon tape, and then I'm not going to mess it up, and then I'm going to just, you know, I don't know, I'll do something with it, but anyway, that's really cool, so, uh, my M1 gas mask, adult medium.